just think I messed up this video. Damn it. vlog I was trying to hurry up and um it's raining I was trying to hurry up and get this vlog done or submit it for y'all to be watching right now <laughs> but god damn it I think I messed something up Ugh. my mind I just be trying to do so much oh my god I be trying to do so much Okay, anyways, so I am. He's walking his dog in the rain. So I am going drop some stuff off to Trey. Some sunglasses. I don't know why I said stuff. Some sunglasses to Trey. And Trey lives downtown, so we best to go downtown. And, um. Give him his sunglasses. He's going on a trip. I'm jealous. <laughs> He's going to Miami. I'm telling all his business. I wish I was going to Miami as well. <sighs> but I'm not. I am dying for a vacation. Okay? Somewhere to go. Even though I feel like I just went to LA. I want like a... LA was so quick. LA was like what? Three days? It's three days. It might have been like two and a half. It's like LA was so quick. But I need a real like... I'm going on vacation for days vibe, you know? me almost to that lady <laughs> my god the lights are green and she started walking across the street like what the hell man Trey got you know the downtown vibes and it is so beautiful um I don't know if I would ever live downtown because I just don't really know like much down here I feel like by the Galleria I just know like that's my stomping grounds like West Westheimer area I just know that area I don't know anything like around downtown so yeah but let me show y'all what trey is getting he's getting two sunglasses on my site y'all know the sunglasses is oh my god that would have been tragic if i left it at home and drove down here but he's getting two uh damn, two uh sunglasses two for 20 
and they're cute. So he's getting these tannish brown ones that I have and then these lime green ones. I can't wear, wait to wear these. I really like the lime green. So yeah, he should be coming down soon. I'm drinking coffee. Y'all know the drill. I feel like I'm always drinking coffee. She delivers. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Where have you been? The people have not seen you in forever. Girl, the last vlog you was in was January. It was that long? Mm -hmm. I mean, I've seen you since then, but. So y'all lied. I dyed my hair. I see it. it came out good. Mm -hmm. You didn't have to bleach it? Mm mm. Okay. Surprisingly. I have and I did the mustache and the beard too. Just a little bit. Okay. I'm surprised that that did because the last time I tried to do like my facial hair and my eyebrows. And no. No. Mm -hmm. Um. Hi guys. I've just been working from home. Lying saying I've been exposed to COVID so I can work oh from home. God. It was only supposed to be 10 days. It's been over a month. But. You been home for a month? Yeah girl. Over a month. What? It's going on like five days? weeks. Damn. But hey, that's good. Be she home. delivers. Yeah, you like them? I love them. As soon as you sent me the picture, I was like, yeah, I know I wanted those. I just had to look at my outfits to see what all I was wearing. Those are my favorite in the green. Period. I don't know if I'm wearing them heels, friend. No? I think, because I can walk in those, but I don't know about an all day thing. Uh uh. I don't wear heels. You know what day. I need to get? <laughs> There's a little thing that somebody told me that you could put at like the base of the heel or the. Like, oh, like inside? To keep your foot from sliding or yeah. something? Yeah. Where can you get it from? Aldo. I used to work there, fun fact. Damn. At Lakeside. And I just, and you know what's crazy when I walk past Aldo today in the mall? It's like, something is attracting me to that store. I don't know what it Any is. Any shoe store, like a Journeys, Aldo. I like the green. I think the green is my favorite. Yeah, it's. These it's lenses summer. are darker in person. Mm hmm. That wasn't the vibe. Huh? That wasn't the vibe. No, I actually you like that. Light? Oh. No, 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 no. I like that they darker. Cause I like. I really don't like shades, to be honest. Really? Like when I'm walking around, like the it, the, the distortion of the color it oh, gets to throw, me. Oh, yeah, it throws me off. But, but I do like on. when I'm high. I don't like. I don't like to look high. So I like to cover I my feel eyes. Feel you on that. Mm hmm Y'all feeling I feel these? You on that. I like the green the most, really. Yeah, I got a couple outfits. I'm gonna put these on. I was like, girl, let me let them know. It's giving necklace, Shabjugre. shades. I thought it was going to give me some earrings, but that's going to be a little too gay. I was going to say, you was going with it? Yeah. Because <laughs> I, <got laughs> I got these little shorts that I ordered. Let me just keep this on because it's giving me good light. Oh. I got these little shorts that I ordered, like them Beyonce shorts from Coachella, but they black. And like, Ooh. it's like this, like distressed in the back. You literally see my ass cheeks. Ooh. It's giving with those. We're doing this mukbang next week. So by the time this is out, mm -hmm. y'all can leave comments and give us ideas. Uh huh. So for a part two of our mukbang. Mm -hmm. Well, you did. You came up with an idea. We're not gonna tell y'all. Okay. I do like that idea. You do? Mm -hmm. It literally like. I like that. It popped in my head out of nowhere. Love it. Like I it, haven't seen any of them either, so like, it'll be like a real reaction. Yeah, because I don't really watch them. Excuse me, neither. I'm fucking with that. Okay, girl, so the passport is coming. I'm ready. You know what's crazy? When I told you about my passport, the first thing I thought about was when you, did, you had what? that group text and like everybody. <laughs> I, said, I hate my friends. I don't like none of them. I said, oh my gosh, we all act like black people. Act like the fucking people I be talking about. And you was like, I'm not like that. Like, cause you was like, I be like, okay, let's book it, let's go. And you know what's now, crazy? Nobody said shit. The New York trip though? They have me on call that Sunday, so I have to take off that Friday. No, I'm talking about the, the Sunday before. Oh. So the 21st, I think that Friday, I'll be mm -hmm. off. Like, I have to take off, so I'm going to have a three-day weekend. So it's really giving Leslie Thursday night in Florida. All right. Well, 
He gotta go. Stay tuned <laughs> for the mukbang. We already have an idea, but mm -hmm. just for comment purposes, give us some ideas. Y'all, let's uh, give us some ideas and suggestions because what if somebody actually suggests This will that? come on like Monday. So mm -hmm. y'all will have enough time to comment before we film. I'm going to Galveston Friday, so we gotta film between Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Are you going to the fake beach? It's the family trip. Oh, okay. For Mother's Day. All right. Yeah. Tell me how much to send you for my shades. They Shop. Her. <laughs> Shop. Jew Grayway. She delivers. No, she don't deliver. She delivers for me. Sorry. I'm going to say I don't deliver. Y'all can pick up though. Uh, all right, boo. Thank you. I'm, I'm going to go take like, pictures with these shorts. So I'm going to send them to you. And send them to me. It happened in Miami. I will I'm do. Jealous. I'm going to try not to come back broke. Time, oh, girl. Have fun. See you later, friend. All right. He was sitting on my keys the whole time. He could have moved that. <laughs> Digging into his damn bag. Okay, y'all. Right next. Um. My cousin just posted this. This should look good as hell. I've been wanting to try a, what do you call these? Burrito, burrito tacos. This should look so good. Um, okay. Uh, let's go home guys so it's friday okay i am such a child i <laughs> i literally sipped the coffee and it just a drop just boop not a, not from my mouth from the cup let me show y'all this leaky ass cup like why do they do that like just leaking Annoying, but it's hot as hell in this building right now. I feel like they have the heat on. It's hot. Hey guys, happy Friday! I am so happy it's Friday. Oh my goodness. So I'm on my lunch break right now. I am going to my cousin's school. My cousin is only like 10 minutes from my school. Her school is in A Leaf though. So I'm going to run to her real quick to drop off something to her. And then I'm going to get me a smoothie $5 Friday. So I'm going to get my hair cut. Well, not cut, but trimmed. I'm going to get my hair trimmed at 3. I'm going to get my hair trimmed at 3. And I don't know. I'm kind of nervous. I know that my hair is like very, very damaged. And I'm really scared like what she's gonna say so I'm pretty much going to get a trim but I want her to kind of give me a consultation in a sense like tell me what I need so that I can go back I feel like she's gonna tell me I need that Olaplex treatment I kind of want the diva cut diva curl cut so like it can hang in my face too I don't know we'll see what she says I'm nervous though because I really don't want to take a lot of length off of my hair it's growing but I know it's really damaged so we'll see um the weather is horrible it's been rainy and ugly but I really had the urge to go out like I really want to go to like a happy I don't know I just want to do something I just want to engage you know with people like socially interact I just want like, I want your holiday. You know what I'm saying? Like, I just want to feel a male companion. Like, just energy. I just don't be around nobody. So, we'll see. But I don't really like to go out when it's rainy and ugly outside. I'd rather just stay inside. So, we'll see what I do. But, I guess I'll check in with y'all. Um, I don't know, maybe when I get my smoothie. I'm almost at my cousin's school, so I have to pull up on them. Happy Saturday. I am sweaty, just left the gym. I am about to go get my eyebrows done. I really need my eyebrows done. So I'm going to get my eyebrows done, and then I'm going to go run to the grocery store. And um, go home. It's like 10 a.m. Um, I might get a coffee. I kind of want a coffee. What's new? So I think I'm gonna go to Starbucks first. Go get my eyebrows and then go to the um grocery store. I'm mad because I don't have a disposable mask with me. And I prefer 
to wear like a disposable mask when I'm going places like that. So I can just throw it away when I get home. But I guess I'm gonna have to wear my little cotton mask. I'm gonna wear that. Okay. So I did want to tell y'all about my trim, but that'll be like a whole nother story when I start doing my hair. I need to do something to my hair. My eyebrows need to be done so bad. I feel like I'm breaking out right here. Yeah. <laughs> tell if they even done i don't know i'm just not feeling my eyebrows as of recently and i guess i have like a bump right here i don't know what this is what's happening to my face okay so i hate when there's a million parking spots and somebody can park right next to me hate it so i'm about to go all right she cute with her little gucci bag or whatever <laughs> Okay, we're about to go to the Krogs. I need to go to Kroger. I don't know. I feel like you can't tell that I got them done. Is it me? Am I tripping? Like, this one feel like it needs to still be cleaned up. I don't know, man. I just can't find a good person to do my eyebrows. If y'all know an eyebrow person, please let me know. I will try them. I don't care if it's threading, waxing whatever I feel like I still need them done whatever okay let's go to Kroger Okay, home, clean. I just put conditioner in my hair because I had washed it on Thursday, Saturday. So I just conditioned it so it's easier for me to detangle. But, I don't know if y'all noticed. I feel like you can't tell, of course. So what happened? I don't know, I kind of have like mixed feelings. This girl is supposed to be like really, really good. Really, really good. And like specialized, you know, in curly hair. But... I don't know it's just everything to me first impressions are everything and when I got there my appointment was for three I literally sat down I walked in at 258 I'm like hey I have an appointment at three 
and she has she says okay so she has somebody in her chair and i'm like okay well that's pretty normal like all hairdressers do shit like that so i go talk to my friend who's in the front of the shop in her own little shop and when I come back, a different person is in the chair. And I'm like, and at this point, it's like 3.20. And I'm like, why would you set an appointment at 3 if you already booked? Like, you have people. You know, I don't like that. Like, because I don't like to waste time. And so, it was supposed to be from 3 to 3.30, just a quick trim. So, I sit down in the chair at like 3.20. And so, she says that... <laughs> Because I requested a trim, and mind you, we emailed back and forth. My hair was in a bun, y'all saw me. And she says that she can't really tell, um, like, how much to do with the trim because she can't tell my curl pattern because it was just in a bun, like, slicked. So, you know, my hair wasn't really curly. And so I'm like, well, you didn't specify that I should have come with my hair. Like, she mentioned it's not really, like, in a wash and go state. But you never mentioned I should have had that. I would have came with my hair wet if that was the case. So I don't know. It's just the communication. So then she says, well, because I can't really tell, I don't really want to cut too much. Cool. Because I don't even want to cut too much either. So she was like, well, do you want to just come back? At this point, I'm like, no, I came all the way downtown. I, I want something. So I just asked her to trim it. She literally took like a quarter of an inch off. There was really no hair on the floor. So I don't know if you can even tell that it's trimmed. I kind I can feel it, but I don't know if you can tell. And so she's like, well, I'll just do a quick little trim. And then you can come back and we'll do like the full works. And I'm like, okay, cool. So when I got off the chair and I looked and saw there was really no hair on the ground, she charged me $40 for a quarter. I don't know. I just feel like, and I would get... Like, I'm paying you for your time. But she really didn't take no time. It was really like five minutes. And I was waiting on you. You were late. I don't know. I just don't know how I feel about that. I feel like that was a lot. You know you didn't really do anything. So you had to charge me the full amount. $40 for her. what? Like, there was really no trim. So, I don't know. I just I kind of feel indifferent about that. Because I feel like that was $40 for nothing. Like, I really could have just went to Supercuts and had them trim it for, like, $20. I don't know I'm, like I said I'm indifferent because it's like well she said she couldn't do much but you didn't communicate that I should have had my hair a certain way to trim it I don't know it was just a lot of miscommunication so I'm supposed to go back in like a week or so a week and a half or something like two weeks two weeks I'm supposed to go back and let her do a treatment and I guess she'll do like a really curly cut I don't know I just I don't know I really just don't feel like she should have charged me $40 for nothing. She could have charged me like $15, $20, a, a fraction of the price. Because, you know, you didn't really do anything. I don't know. Again, that could just be me. Maybe y'all feel different. I could be tripping or whatever. And like I said, the first impression of just like... Uh, <laughs> I was waiting on you. Whatever. That's why I really be just trying to do everything myself, do my hair myself, <laughs> do my eyebrows myself. I just be want to do everything myself because I'm never really satisfied with how things come out. And I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. So I really wanted to do something today, but I have no friends. <laughs> I have nobody to do anything with. So I guess I'll just be at home per usual doing nothing. These are the times I really need a boyfriend because I don't have to worry about friends. I could be like, babe, let's go here. Let's go here. <sighs> don't got one of those either. So I am going to prep my hair just in case I do go somewhere. I'm going to um, just put it up in a bun my hair I let it naturally dry that way just high up in the bun for some reason I don't know and I don't use a diffuser because I feel like I don't want to put heat on my hair so I just put it like this and let it air dry and my curls be good so I'm prepping it 
for a possible go out. And I didn't want to go like out, out like a club or nothing. I wanted to go to like a restaurant, bar type, loungey type during the day. But yeah, <laughs> again, no friends. If I do do something though, of course I will come on and vlog it. Look how, get that curl, whoa. Whoa. Can y'all tell my eyebrows now, do they look good? <laughs> do they look decent? It's raining. So, it's raining outside. I'm just eating half of a bagel with butter. A plain bagel and butter. So, I'm about to do my makeup. I'm going somewhere. So, I already have moisturizer on my face. I'm about to put this um, Lancome, what is this, primer. <clears throat> so, I didn't know if to do my makeup first or my hair first. What do y'all usually do? Y'all hair first and then makeup? Huh, I don't know really how I want to do my hair since it's raining I was gonna put a, either a bucket hat or a scarf on I have this really cute tan and brown scarf so I don't know I don't know I don't want to do my hair yet because I don't know what I'm doing to my hair so let's just beat the face so I'm gonna put this translucent powder on my cousin got me on this as well as like you know a million other people <laughs> the Laura Mercier translucent powder I put this on first before I put my foundation and stuff on so <clears throat> we're gonna pat this on I'm not about to do like a whole walkthrough and stuff of my makeup because video would be three hours long but I did want to talk to y'all so I'm going to a restaurant I think we're going we have a few options where we want to go and I think it's gonna be me and two of my cousins we'll see I am so pale I feel like I usually have more color than this but I am so pale my shirt the powder make me look even more pale so I put the powder and then I'm gonna spray my face with this Mario Badescu um like facial spray so I don't look super dry hydrate the face and then I'm gonna put my foundation on okay I'm ready this is bothering me though this one little piece of hair is bothering me. I'll show you my outfit. I don't have no shoes on because I don't know what shoes I'm wearing yet. But I'm wearing this scarf. I got this scarf from, um, I don't even know if y'all can really see because it is so dark in here. <clears throat> so I did get this scarf from Fashion Nova. And I just put my curly clip ins in. Let's hope. It stays, and then I have my cross on. These are all my jewelry, really. <laughs> and then I just took the shirt so you can see the shape. Okay. You? Yep. Yeah. No, I'm right here. Oh, I'm going to uh, move my car right now, right? Okay. Happy Sunday. So it's like maybe one, two o'clock p.m. I just finished doing laundry, and I also woke up early and cooked. I make gumbo and my brother rated it at 8.5 out of 10 so we're getting close to my mama 
my mama told me how to make it but you know it don't taste like hers yet let's see it must be all right So I just made a little shrimp, chicken, and sausage gumbo. 8.5. So I am also about to go and put this backdrop up. Redo my backdrop because I definitely want to film some videos for y'all. I've been wanting to film a bunch of hauls. So I need to get my backdrop and background together. Um, I have an idea of what I want to do though, so we'll see. So I did want to show y'all a little perfume haul. So, um, a lot of this perfume I've been having forever or like been wearing it forever. I only have two new additions. I don't really have that big of a perfume collection first of all, but here it is. It's not, not major at all, but... I wanted to show y'all what I do have. So I'm gonna start with my favorite, my absolute favorite. So this is the Gucci Guilty. I've been wearing Gucci Guilty since it first came out. And I love this scent. I always get it for Christmas. And yeah, I got this one like two Christmases ago actually. I know because the pandemic not really going nowhere. But I really only wear this on special occasions. So this is like my i'm going out on a date or like birthday nighttime that's when i wear this so i still have a lot left and it came in a set so that's the the lotion but that's like one of my favorites um the next favorite i have is this chloe y'all chloe smells so good but to me oh my god this is like a daytime scent but dressed up too you know so like a brunch I'm going to brunch or like, I don't know, bridal shower, baby shower. It's like daytime dressy. It smells so good. It's just very like girly and dainty to me. So this is Chloe. And that's obviously more on the expensive side. So it's the Gucci Guilty, more on the expensive. And then of course, Chanel is expensive, right? So this is the Coco. This is Mademoiselle. Yeah, Coco Chanel. Mademoiselle. This is like very mature like grown adult so and it's only a little bit left this really is like special occasion so this is like i don't know graduation like i don't wear this one often at all so actually the story behind this this was my mama's and she got a new one she got the um the one that's it wasn't this one what's the one that's pink it wasn't number five Number five is like gold and a black bottle. Um, is it Mademoiselle? No, this is Mademoiselle. I don't know, but she got another one. She got another scent. And so she gave me this one and it was like about halfway. And so yeah, I've been having this for like two years now too. And again, I only wear this one when it's like, I don't know, like really special. Maybe this like a birthday, birthday at night. Oh no, it's not like a daytime everyday scent. It's too like it's strong. And this is like, you know, nighttime scent as well. This is not something I would wear during the day. So that's the the more expensive ones, right? Let me show you all these. Okay. So I got this one for Christmas this year, and this is Vince Camuto. And um, you know, this it's not in a glass bottle, so it's like a spray more so than a perfume, I would say. This is like an everyday. So I wear this one to work. So this is a work one. My brother is calling me. Yellow? Uh, I can, yes. So yeah, this one is like a everyday. It smells so good, but it's not like dressy. And it's, you know, more on the inexpensive side. So I wear this one to work every day. This is my daytime work scent. But y'all... 
oh and this one is inexpensive like you can get this from marshall's or tj maxx somewhere like that um my next favorite scent i'm obsessed with this scent i've only had this for like a month and i've already used so much see that so this is from zara and my best friend put me on this zara's perfume smells so good oh my god so this is what i had on yesterday when i went out i went out during the day yesterday <sighs> smells so good so it's like a chill vibe but very fresh and spring it felt yeah it's a fresh smell it smells very fresh oh it smells so good so this is the royal softness i guess that's the uh the scent royal softness from zara yo so 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 good it smells so good so that's my little mini perfume haul that's the ones i wear and i don't know about y'all but i feel like perfumes have occasions you know like this is not an everyday scent at all um chanel chloe is definitely like daytime dressy you know like a wedding daytime you know more dressy daytime gucci guilty is a definitely a nighttime scent i feel like this the zara and the vince Camuto one this one is more of like a everyday casual scent but they smell so good good morning vlog excuse the music that's blowing in right now but i am at the gym and so we're about to get this workout in never miss a monday got back from the gym it is like 5 58 a.m or 6 at this point so i'm about to clean I'm about to clean Mowgli's litter box and feed him. He's going bananas on the ground right now. Mowgli, come here. <laughs> you be targeting so early. Mowgli, come here. 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 Anyways, so it's Monday. And I have a lot to do today. I have a lot of work to do at work. And I also have something to do after work, so I'm trying to like prepare myself for this long day. Okay, so I'm about to feed him. He keeps pouring out his water. I'm telling y'all, he's bad. He pours his water out, his food out. Y'all see this? See how he knocks his food out the bowl? Yeah, come over here and show the people what you be doing. He knocks his food out the bowl. Move, move. He spills his water, and I'm not picking it up, so he's gonna have to just eat it off the mat. He cuts up. Every time I fill his water bowl, he pours it out. Why are you so bad? Okay. <laughs> so it's Monday evening. I came home and took a nap. So it's like seven, and I'm not eating dinner. I'm just gonna drink this protein shake. I had a little bit of the gumbo left over for lunch, a little bit. And then when I got home, I ate a bagel and now I'm eating this or drinking this. I'm really trying to get fine as hell for these trips I have coming up. So yeah, it's a little sacrifice, but I'm really not hungry. So I'm gonna drink this protein shake and make a coffee. So I was just telling y'all that he be cutting up. He poured his water out his bowl again. Like, I don't know why he keeps doing it. What? Stop, Molly. Oh my God, you got beef? You beefed out right now? He really just tried to trick me. Molly, stop. Can you tell the people how bad you are? You try to act like you so innocent and they just think you so cute. Moga. <laughs> He's purring. He's just bad. Okay, so, but why he following me though? I'm about to put my backdrop back up. So, I think I'm gonna need my assistant law to help. I need my assistant law to help me so that it's even and it, you know it looks right. Let's see if she can help me. Okay, I think I'm set up. It's super wrinkle. I didn't even think to like iron it. But um, 
I'm trying to decide do I want to add my stuff that I had on the background before. I'm going to see. I'm going to do like a little test run filming setup and see if I want to still add the leaves and stuff. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Okay, so I was trying to test it out and see if I liked this background. If I wanted to put my lights back up and my little leaves. <sighs> we'll see. It's hot as hell in this garage though. And I'm starting to sweat, so I'm gonna go back inside. Okay, so it is really hot outside. So I came back inside. And I feel a little, a little dewy. So I do think I am going to go Take my shower. My eyebrows look good from this angle, y'all. Hmm. And I don't even got no makeup on. <laughs> so, I think I'm going to end this vlog right here for you all to enjoy. I hope you all have a great week. And, um, stay tuned because the hauls, the hauls are coming. <laughs>